Good afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon. Today is Sunday, uh, March 13th. And welcome to another edition of Joanna's Jazzy Jewel. I just want to take this opportunity to welcome uh, everyone to the live. Welcome everybody. Uh, I am Joanna of Joanna's Jazzy Jewel. And what I do is I sell $5.00. Jewelry, okay, paparazzi jewelry. Uh, and on Sundays uh, at 7, uh, we get kicked off. And what I also do is I give away jewelry, okay. So for all of you all who are coming on in, just take the opportunity to share this video to your uh, timeline, please. Uh, don't share it in any Facebook groups because sometimes they will block you. So if you'll just come on in and share it to your timeline and come back and let me know that you shared it, okay? All right, so what we do for those of you uh, who have never um, observed this particular uh, activity before, this live, I show the jury, I assign a number to the jury, and then uh, if you like what you see in the comment section, you'll comment Jazzy, and then the number of the jury that you like, okay? Jazzy, and then the number that you like. I'm trying to get this on. Let's see, pages. Oh, well. Sometimes things just don't work out like you want them to work out. And, you know, it is what it is. I'm going to take this opportunity and share this to my business page. And for those of you who are on my personal page, at some point, we're going to want to go back over to the business page. At some point in our history. Uh -huh. And get it all set up over there. Okay, and I'm good that you all will work with me on that one. Not to the, today, but at some point. All right, so we're going to get tonight started out with this beautiful, and I may have shown this on Friday night. I think I did. This is a, a magnetic bracelet here. The name of this bracelet is called the Tahoe Tourist. It is a black bracelet. It does have um, a couple of, uh, it's a lot of leather-like. It has one, two, five different bands on it. One of them is a white band. You see here that has that little water-like pattern on it. And the other has the little black beads on it. And it just snaps together. It's magnetized, okay? Very, very easy to wear. Uh, and I consider that my wrist is pretty large. So it's it'll, it'll fit. It'll fit a large wrist, okay? If you like it, the number for it is going to be Jazzy82. Jazzy82. And y'all, this is, this is, I'm going to say this a hundred times tonight maybe, but this is actually very cute on too. I tried it on um, Thursday just to see if it would fit me, and it did. I was shocked. I said, somebody don't hurry up and grab that one. There's a lot of treasure I think in a lot of the pieces that uh, paparazzi is coming up with, those vintage pieces, and then the new ones also. This next uh, item says, Be still and know that I am God. Psalms 46 and 10. Y'all said I had to get a little help there. Okay. Be still and know that I am God. And it is a silver um, necklace, a short silver necklace. You see there on the corded chain. It does come with the complimentary earrings there and uh, a two-inch extender. But it is a um, choker-like necklace, okay? It is short. The number for this is going to be Jazzy 61. Jazzy 61. That is so cute. And again, that's Psalms 46 and 10, uh, that particular scripture. So for all of... Uh, the people who want to have those little inspirational sayings, you know, we need it in this day and time. We need the Lord. Oh, do we need him? So, you know, just a reminder 
I like the um, jewelry with the scriptures on it. And that's the wonderful thing about working with uh, paparazzi is that um, there are a lot of Christians um, that operate and work uh, in this particular company. I found that to be very re refreshing, especially in this time. Okay, you ladies come on in. I also have this little nice silver. Hello, Miss Coley. Hello, hello, hello. This nice, um, this also has that water uh, like pattern on it. This is a nice pair of clip on earrings uh, that you can see here. They are clip on, uh, it has that design there. And look at this. Good evening, Jazzy61. I'm telling you, you're going to like that, precious. All right, let me put you while I'm doing all this talking, like Mama said the other night. <laughs> Jazzy61, got you, precious. It's, it's going to be cute. You know, I'll bring it by there tomorrow, maybe. All right, and so this here has a pearl, has the pearl, as you see here, with the dangling uh, silver at the bottom with that water um, wave look on it. This is Jazzy 85. Jazzy 85. Let's see what the name of this one is. It's called Vin Vintage Veracity. It's a white clip-on earrings for all of you all who don't have uh, pierced ears. Next, I want to show you this. I'm going to show another uh, two pieces, and then we're going to... Uh, you're off tomorrow. Oh, and you'll be back. Well, okay, I'll wait till Wednesday. i got to remind myself. Okay, I'll wait till Wednesday to bring it by. All right. No worries. Lucky you, you're off two days. Okay. Um... You know what I just thought about? You can engrave this real easy. This is a black bracelet here. It's just a hinge bracelet right there. And it just opens up. You stick your arm in and you put it back. Okay. It's a little asymmetrical. Very very uh, neat uh, design there. The number for this one is going to be Jazzy 7. Jazzy 7. For that if you like it. I hope you all had a wonderful, wonderful um, Sunday. Ain't been too long. Got up. I decided to take a nap. Uh, or I tried to. Lay down. I was reading. Had to book me. Y'all read something. You know, you, you, you were reading this thing. You know, <laughs> you going to sleep. <laughs> and I wasn't reading the Bible. I was actually... Uh, read a novel and went right on to sleep on the good part. Okay, love you to pieces. This is a multicolored bracelet here. Hello, Miss Jewel. Hello, hello, hello. This is you right on time. I thought you were gonna make it tonight. This, this, look at this reminds me of candy all day long. Okay, it is very, it's for the spring that's coming up, y'all, with all those beautiful spring colors. And then it has the two charms down here, a heart, and then almost, I don't know what that other little thing is. kind of reminds me of a little bell. But this is cute, too. All right, and this goes, it's going to go with all of your um, spring colors. The number for this is going to be Jazzy29. Get you one of these for your little girl when, when she put on all those bright colors for Easter. I thought about that. I was like, Easter's coming up. You know, and, and uh, paparazzi's coming out with the colors. They are not shy about that. Next, we have these fish hook back earrings here. These are some white earrings that you see. And they do have the pieces on them that move them with the, with the silver um, spacers there. It's called Loudly Layered White Earring. The number for this one is going to be Jazzy 27. Jazzy 27. Miss Jewel, you might want to go back and watch the replay a little bit. I've shown a couple of pieces already. Okay. All right. One more pair of earrings. We're going to have our first question for tonight. <clears throat> Look at these. I don't know if this looks like a person. It looks like a symbol on a music sheet or what. But the design on this is very unique and it's different. I have an appreciation for things that are different. It's called Harmoniously Balanced. This is a silver earring here. It does have a fish hook back there. The number for this nice, lovely pair of earrings is going to be Jazzy 2024. 20, Jazzy 24. All right. I just want to take the time to welcome everybody to the live, and we're going to get, get started with our first question. 
All right, y'all ready? Gotta get y'all to get a magnifying glass. Oh Lord! Now this one is. Oh Lord, I ain't gonna ask that question because it ain't got nothing to do with the Bible. It just got something to do with what folk think in the Bible. Cause I ain't never heard that. All right. What question did Jesus ask Peter a fruit a few F E W times written within one conversation? Afterward, adding to the instruction, feed my sheep. All right. I'll ask again. What question did Jesus ask Peter a few times within one conversation? And afterward, Jesus added the instructions, feed my sheep. But he asked Peter a question first. What do he ask him? Do you love me more than these? This is what Linda Coley says. Do you love me? Do you love me? Okay, precious Ann. I seen it first with Linda Coley. He asked him, yes. According to John 21, 15 through 17, Jesus says, love is thou me. Um, or do you love me? Yes. I told y'all, y'all been going to church. Y'all remember them, um, them Sunday school lessons or whatever. All right. So we got uh, Sister Coley done broke out of the stall first. We're going to see what's going to happen. Who's going to round off, come around. Who knows? This, I mean, this is the first question of the night. And I filled up the bags with some goodies. I don't think I got a gag gift. Y'all don't like my little tree necklace I've been trying to give away last few weeks. That's all right. That's all right. I took it out. I took it out. Hey, Diane. Yep, okay, that's a good. I took it out. Did I send your thing? No, I did not. Did I? I don't think I did. I'll send it. Your uh, invoice for last time for your free gift. All right, the name of this bracelet is called Urban Rain. R E I G N. You know, like he rains forever. Okay, never mind. All right, so. This one is um, multicolor because it has black, it has steel gray, and it has um, those rhinestones in there. I don't know if y'all could see it. You know, you have to get it just so. Because if I bring it in too close, see, it's, I don't know. But anyway, it has three different colors there going on in it. It is a hinge bracelet. All you have to do, you know, if you want to put it on, is open it up and then clasp it back. Okay, well, it's not a clasp, but uh, there is a little hole in there. And just stick the part in there in the hole. This is very neat. It's very durable, it seems. Um, the number for this one is Jazzy 79. Jazzy 79. Now I want to show to you... I want to give you a visual of this next piece. You want 24 earrings? Oh, Miss Jewel, you like these? That's what you're talking about? That's 24. That's different. Okay, let me put down Miss Jewel 24 earrings. Got you. And, uh, Precious, I got you for the, um, Psalms 4610 necklace. All right. Y'all, look at this. Now, I showed this on last week, I think. And I showed it, it may have been, I don't know if I showed it last week or not. I think I did. It was in that steel gray, okay, that dark, uh, metal gray. Now, this one is, is, uh, it's the same pattern of necklace. Except, instead of it being that gray color, we have it here. And this loud rhinestone. Okay, Miss Jewel, I got you. Okay, we have it here in this uh, large rhinestone. Look at that. Look at that glass. Okay, the sheer elegance of that. Comes with the complimentary matching earrings that you can see there. Does have that two-inch extender, so you'll be able to extend it out a little bit more. I think I like the um, gray one better than this one. Uh, but then it just depends on what you want to wear it with, I guess. Okay? The number for this is going to be Jazzy 63. Jazzy 63. And I have a couple of... I didn't uh, break out anything. But if you like that and you want a bracelet to go with it, I can match it up for you. Okay? And that's one piece. That whole little piece that goes around there is just one piece. 
Now, I also know this is a, also an encore piece um, that I'm showing again because sometimes I have more more customers on Sunday most times than I do on any other uh, day if I'm showing. So I want to break this back out again. This is an encore piece, meaning I did show it once before. Y'all, this is a beautiful butterfly necklace. I love it. I think I'm going to get myself one. It's a copper necklace. It's called Butterfly Prairies. Okay. Uh, it does come with the tassel earrings. Uh, those are the uh, staple earrings. Uh, Paparazzi has two staple earrings. Uh, this is one of them. The tassel, as you can see, it does have a two inch extender. And it's, this is just too cute to me. I think I'm going to do it. I don't have anything against those tassels, but I do love, I love these butterfly earrings. Every time I show them, I tell you all that. Okay, but they are extra cute. They also have that 3D effect going on on them, in my opinion. Uh, when you look at these, um, this is what you'll get. Okay, you see that? All right, and to match them up here, uh oh, let me turn them around, with this butterfly necklace, does have the copper look going to it. I think it's just double cute. Double, double, double. Cute, cute, cute. And the number for the set. Now, if you just want the earrings and you don't want, uh, you know, you can break you can break the look up. It's totally left up to you. And the number is going to be Jazzy23 for the necklace, however. And that will be 23 ear if you want the earrings, 23 neck if you want the necklace only. If you want them both, you're going to say 23 set. I'm going to show one more set and we're going to move on with our next question of the night because I got some jewelry that I want to give away. All right. Now, on this next set, I'm going to give you some options, meaning I have two bracelets to go with this nice necklace. All right. Y'all know what I decided this week, this weekend. Uh, green used to be my favorite color long years ago. I'm back at green. Green is not not this maybe this particular green, but I'm back at green being my favorite color. I like the Kelly greens, the dark greens. I thought it was this hot pink, but I love love green. So this is a uh, a mint green here. It has um some off white, almost another layer of mint green. And then you have your rhinestones about. This is a short necklace. It does come with the complimentary uh, mint green earrings that you see there. Okay, nice uh, short necklace there. Uh, it's just a little bit off my short display. Um, so with it, I have two necklaces. Let me give the I um, mean two bracelets. The necklace is going to be Jazzy 86, okay? Jazzy 86. I'm going to do it up close so that you can see it up close and personal. 86 for the necklace. Now I have two bracelets that will pair very well uh, with this mint green necklace. The first, the first bracelet is this nice stretch bracelet here. You see it has the diamond shaped mint green gems in it. Those have the um, silver spaces there. The number for this one is going to be 62. Jazzy 62 to go with that necklace. The second bracelet is going to be Jazzy 66. Now this necklace is a bangle ne necklace. It doesn't stretch. You just put it on. But it has those mint green layers there to it on this solid silver um, stay in there or frame. All right, so it is a bangle bracelet, Jazzy 66. Both of them will go with this necklace, I think. All right, some of you may already have a mint green bracelet, um, and you just may want to add uh, this necklace to uh, your collection, your growing jewelry collection. All right, I said I'm going to get rid of all my old jewelry and fill my thing up with paparazzi. Okay, every time I say that, it just never happens. Ah! And I'm not a storyteller. I am going to clear it out some, though. And by the way, Miss Jewel's supposed to be bringing me a jewelry box. By the way, just want to throw that out there. All right. I may have asked this question before. No, I didn't. Y'all listen to this question. It's about the Ten Commandments, okay? How many of the Ten Commandments do not begin with the words, Thou shall not? I got this one wrong. 
How many of the Ten Commandments do not begin with the words, Thou shall not? Okay. Somebody give me a number. Okay. It's not four, Miss Coley. It's not three, Miss Jewel. <laughs> okay. Thou shall not. How many do not begin with it? So we know that quite a few begin with it. So think about the question. How many do not begin with thou shall not? And um, nope, it's not two, Miss Jewel. It's coming from Exodus. The 20th chapter. Somebody go help themselves. Exodus, the 20th chapter. Not five. Not five. Not five. Not five. Y'all must have been typing that at the same time. Because both of y'all put five. <laughs> so, think about it. There's a lot of thou shall nots, huh? Or are there just a few? It's not four. It's not seven. How many? It's not six. How many of the Ten Commandments do not begin with the words, Thou shall not? It's not six. Most of them don't begin with that. So, let me say it that way. It's not one. Y'all in the... Okay, maybe I just gave you a hint. Most okay, how many of the Ten Commandments do not begin with the words thou shall not? It's not seven. Now, by process of elimination, scroll back up and see what numbers have not been given. Finally, it's eight. Thank you, precious. <laughs> Oh, yes. I seen Precious with the eight first. Okay. All right. Now y'all doing eight. <laughs> now everybody coming in with eight. Okay. I saw Precious first. Now, I had bragged on y'all. Now I'm taking it. I'm taking my break back. <laughs> All right, Miss Julius. Eight. Precious got it. Okay. All right. That was a good run there, ladies. That was, <laughs> that was a good run. That was a good run. Y'all remember that question. We may have it again. Like I did one time before. Ask the question again. When you get wrong, I may ask it again. So to, so to see who remembered. Okay, this was a piece also from uh, for Thursday. Or Friday. I don't even know what day I came on. But uh, this is a, a beautiful piece here. This nice wooden... Uh, um, necklace has the wooden beads there with the silver spaces in between and then it has that cork like uh center there all right that's very very unique and different comes with the complimentary matching earrings okay that has the brown silver uh, uh with the silver balls down there at the end uh i have paired it up with a nice wooden bracelet this is my tricolor wooden bracelet i think this is also nice i'm gonna tell you i don't there isn't a wooden piece that i don't own that i don't like okay um <clears throat> that i have left for all the wooden pieces that i have i like and that that is the the god in heaven truth i don't say things i don't mean and i don't mean things that i don't say so uh, but this is a beautiful piece here with this brown going on. I think this is a two-piece deal. That is cute. I don't care what y'all say. The number for this one is Jazzy 40. For that nice, lovely um, wooden two-piece set. If you want to break it up, please feel free to do so. I won't be mad with you. Okay. Now, I'm back to some more options. With this next necklace that I'm about to show, I do have two bracelets that I want to show to go along with, okay? And if I would have taken the time, I probably could have found another pair of, uh, uh, of earrings to match, but I did not. 
All right, this is a nice golden chain. It may not look like it, but the chain is gold. And there's a gold overlay uh, that you may be able to see that's behind there. This is a ivory colored, um, I don't know what kind of flower that is, but some kind of flower, along with these rhinestone flowers, but it is encased in gold there, okay? It does come... Uh, with those pop uh, paparazzi staple earrings there, the studs that are uh, rhinestone also. This is a cute flower. I love flowers, by the way. If you ever look at any of my pages, you're going to be able to see that I love flowers. I love, love, love them. <clears throat> the number for this is uh, Jazzy84. Jazzy84 for this particular necklace. Now... To go with it, I've blinged out the bracelet, as you can see here. It is a gold bracelet. It is, this bracelet is different. It's going to match with this necklace, but it is different in that it is, number one, it is a cuff, but it is one that will automatically go together. You just stick it on. It is a stretch cuff. That's different, all right? It's with this double, I want to call it a double helix, but this double row of um, rhinestones that's set in gold. The number for this particular bracelet is going to be Jazzy 64. And even if you just want to get it by itself, because it is, it is cute with a K. Let me put it on for you, okay? You just put it on, boom. And instantly, well, if I get the tag out of the way, look at that. Look at how much, look at how much it just jazzes up uh, my arm there. And I meant to say that, I meant to play on words on that one. But I think it's a nice addition to to this particular and um, necklace. I also have a gold tone. Uh, this is also rhinestones here. Uh, it just have the gold link with it. All right, it's gonna match up with that part of the necklace there. I think that is also a gem. Uh, this is a clasp bracelet, and the number for it is going to be Jazzy Eight. Jazzy 8. Now, if you want to get it separately, please feel free to do so. It is totally left up to you. But again, that's a darling uh, of a necklace there. All right. All right. Let's get down to the questions. Let's ask. Let's see. We got Miss Linda with one and Miss Precious with one. Let's see who's going to be um, who's going to be the winner of our first um, giveaway tonight. What woman in the Old Testament was described as having weak eyes? What woman in the Bible was described as having weak eyes? Jazzy 40 bracelet for Miss Coley. Gotcha. All right. What woman in the Bible was described as having weak eyes? Come on, y'all knew that one. Because I, I think I said her sister, but <laughs> I got you for the bracelet. Jazzy 40 bracelet. And this will be found in the 29th chapter of Genesis. So you know it's going to be an Old Testament, I told you, but Genesis, 29th chapter. She was described as having weak eyes. Leah, yes. Who is that, Miss Jewel Finale? <laughs> All right, Diane, you got it. You got it. You got it. It was not Delilah. <laughs> I don't think Delilah had no weak eyes now. She, I don't think Delilah had a weak nothing. <laughs> so we just. <laughs> hey, Lord have mercy. Okay. That, that sister, she was something else. I tell you the truth. All right, let's let's move on. We'll get a we'll get a question. We'll get in another question. So right now, that one Diane got that one. Diane Timson got that one. So we got every we got three people with one point. Y'all know my rules. You gotta get two correct answers in order to win the gift. Two correct answers. All right, all right. Leah was the one who was described with the weak eyes. All right, ladies, let's look at this um, long. This is a silver chain. It's that dark silver, though, almost that gray. 
All right, it does have, um, it has some double, um, this, not spacers, but if you'll look closely, you'll see that it has double the, um, you see the parts to the necklace there. Then the spacers are single. This is a long necklace. It comes with the complimentary earrings. Uh, it does have a two inch in extender, but it is a throw and go, which means you just throw it on and go. Hello, Evangelist Knights. All right, with it, I wanted to add this bracelet. As you see here, it is a cuff bracelet. <clears throat> it does have um, just a lot of things going on over there, okay? That is a nice one. The number for this one is going to be Jazzy 1. If you just want the necklace, you'll say one Jazzy 1 necklace. If you just want the bracelet, you'll say one bracelet. If you want them both, ha, huh, you just say one set. All right, I'm going to show one more set, and then we're going to go to our next question. All right, let me get a drink of my water, y'all. I've been drinking so I I cannot believe I actually want to drink water. I was telling my mom earlier today I hadn't drank a cherry coke in over a month. I drunk one on Thursday, Wednesday, I think. It didn't even taste right. I did pray and ask God to help me stop drinking them though. I drank them that I drank them that bad. And he's y'all, I'ma tell you, God answers prayer. I mean, I didn't know how he was gonna do that thing, but he did it. He will answer. And I know that may not have been a prayer, but I'm telling you, it, uh, it works. Trust me. Prayer will work if you work it, but you got to pray it in order to work, okay? For it to work. This next set, the necklace is called Date Night Nouveau. It is a silver necklace. Date Night now. Date Night Nouveau. Here you see you have your black, um, I don't know what these look like. These long, up long pieces. And then you have your silver, your light gray. It's not silver, it's gray. Pieces there is on a short. But this really does fill out your bust line. Trust me when I tell you. It comes with the complimentary earrings there. It does It does have a 2 inch extender. But this is the kind of necklace that you don't really want to hang low. It doesn't look better hanging low. So if you have an open shirt there. It's going to complement that very very nicely. To it I would like to add this lovely. Um, this was somebody's black diamond piece. Wasn't our, our group. But it was somebody. If it is important to you, then it's important. That is so true. He loves us just like that. Well, it was important to me. And I lost 10 pounds just from stop drinking them sodas. Just like the commercial said. And turn around and gain three back. <laughs> I'm going to get them off. I'm going to get them off, though. <laughs> Eating the wrong stuff. Okay? Got to get it straight. But I And I, I'm so glad... That the Lord is so concerned with us. I'm, I'm just so, I'm so glad about that. Mom and I were talking earlier today and, and she was saying that, you know, my mama cried. <laughs> that, that's, <laughs> you know, that's unheard of half the time. But, you know, for what's going on with the people in the Ukraine, it just broke her heart. You know, and I could just imagine how God feels that it, these are his children that he created. And, you know, to see such things. So let's please keep those um, individuals in, in prayer as well as the heads of the Russian state. That God, you know, uh, will send someone there, will get their attention and then just help them. We we got to love our brothers, no matter what nationality that they, they are, where they come from. You know, God has commanded us to love each other. Oh, Lord, I don't want to get off on that soapbox because that's, that's just something sad every day. If we allow it. Back to the jewelry. So, uh, here again, this piece I have to go with that. I think that is a good matchup there. Again, it was somebody's piece. This is a clasp bracelet. Okay, it does have the black and the silver. But it also has um, a lighter color in there. And then that's still gray. So, uh, good matchup, I think. The number for these two pieces is going to be Jazzy 41. If you just want the necklace, you'll say 41 necklace. And then if you just want this beautiful bracelet, and this is the last one that I have, you'll say 41 bracelet. But I also have one with the pinks and the other colors on it. I'll show it at another time, which was our black diamond piece. Okay, which means um, my upline was able to bring that back. Um, based on her sales to her entire team. Okay. 
All right, I said we'd do another. Let's get on it. Y'all ready? Get your fat thumbs ready. Or, I don't know, you may text with your forefingers. I don't know. All right, y'all get ready. This one is so easy. Now, I do want to say I'm not going to cheat. The first person I see on my side is the person who gets the points. Now, this is so easy. Y'all learned this when you were just a little, a little kid. All right, y'all ready? Contact with what prophet's bones once raised a man from the dead. Y'all remember. Don't say the wrong one, though. Contact with what prophet's bones? I would tell y'all remember when they throw that man over there and, and, the, <laughs> and the man woke up. He came in contact with the with this prophet's I know y'all gonna get it wrong. Evangelist Knight, you the first person I seen. Are you trying to say Elijah? Because you got Eliza. Okay, tell me which one you trying to say. Sister Coley was next with Elijah. And Miss Jewel said Ezekiel. Okay, and Diane says uh, Elisha. So I need to know who Evangelist Knight. You didn't spell it right. Tell me who you trying to say. Which one? Which one? You got yes. All right. Uh, I'm. You were trying to say Elijah with a J. That's my question to you. Evangelist Snipes. Because if that's who you were trying to say, I'm going to give you an opportunity. Elijah. Okay. We did all that. I'm sorry. Elijah is not the correct answer. Diane, you were the only one with the right answer. It was Elisha. E-L-I-S-H-A. And you will find that. I knew, I knew, I knew we were going to. I said somebody's going to say Elijah. Just as show. And they did. It was Elisha. And that's in 2 Kings 13 and 21. So it was E-L-I-S-H-A. All right, Diane, you have two points. That means you have won the gift. And I think you remember you have to, um, y'all did a good guess. Y'all did some good guessing. I'm going to tell y'all that. Now that one, I can see how, I can see why y'all would say Ezekiel, even though it wasn't Ezekiel. But I just knew. I said, somebody's going to say Elijah and it wasn't. It was. All right, so got one through five. Give me a number one through five, and that's the bag that you get to look in. If you decide that's what you want, then you get to keep it, and then I'll ask everybody what they what should you do, and they'll give you their opinions. But if you decide you don't want it, and you give me another number, you have to take whatever's in the second bag, okay? Whether you like it or not, and if you don't like it, don't tell me. All right, number three. So, looking in bag number three, y'all got to be dys dyslexic to read it, of course. I don't know how to write backwards. All right, we have one item. Looks like some kind of pearls of some sort. Let's see what we got here. Yeah. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. All right, let me let me lay it right so you can see it right. Bam, as they say. Now I don't know how you feel about this, but um, <laughs> it does have some little dangling um rhinestones and the dangling uh, pearls there. I don't know. It does come with complimentary pearl earrings. Does have a two inch extender on it. What y'all think she should do? Should she keep bag number three? Or should she trade? Keep it or trade it? What y'all think? I don't know. Well, she didn't get y'all time. <laughs> okay, dokie. Okay, for nokie. 
Now, if that is nice, say it, keep it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the laughter, whoever laughing over there. Okay, she says, if that's nice, she don't want to keep it. She want to, she want to go, now, remember, <laughs> let me say this. What's ever in bag number five, whatever is in bag number five, you got to keep it. And if you don't like it, don't tell me. <laughs> Okay, because sometimes y'all know I'm going to have some mess in here. <laughs> okay, it's not what they want, what she want. It's not what who want. Well, you can still say, like Precious said, trade. All right, this is what you got in bag number five. You got two items. I, these are called snap bracelets. If you don't like it, don't tell me. The first snap bracelet is this brown, it, you know, it has two adjustable levels here. And they're called snap bracelets from my point of view because guess what? They just snap into place. Alright, this is this nice brown bracelet there with the uh, copper zigzagging in and out. Let's see. Yeah, the, that's called Gone Rogue. And then you have another brown one here. Ooh, let's look at, this one is a wider one. You may can give that one to your little grandson. I don't know. And give this one. I don't know. You can wear this one when you. I don't know. <laughs> okay. This is this is just a different little design. I can't tell you nothing about it. All I know is that's what it is. All right. But it is on. It is a snap bracelet. And this one has three adjustable lengths to it. So that's what you get. I'll put it in your thing with your other gift from uh, last time. Oh Lord. All right, whoop, there it is. All right, let's move on, ladies, to our next $5 piece that I'm going to show y'all. And I'm telling y'all, it is going to be fun. Now, I'm going to laugh at that right there. You know, I want to see you with it on. One of them, you know, one of them little long, wide dresses with that uh, uh, skirts that you be wearing look so good on you. Okay. All right, I got you. Now, if anybody else wants to purchase one of those items, either one of those, or even that necklace, it's only $5 plus tax. Remember that. the um, You can um, buy these items that's in the bags. All right? All right. Moving right along. <laughs> Let me do it to my old. Okay, moving right along. We do have this black and then this steel gray. Okay, necklace here is kind of like the one that I just previously showed is exactly like it, except it has alternating colors in it. And the, what's the name of this one? This one is still called Date Night uh, Nouveau. But with it, I have added, look at this bracelet, ladies. It has that uh, elongated black uh, little set in there. All right, with the alternating silver filigree parts to it. So this is a two-piece set if you like it. The number for it is going to be Jazzy 47. Jazzy 47 for this two-piece. If you just want the necklace, you'll say 47 necklace. If you just want the bracelet, you'll say 47 bracelet. If you like them both, you'll say 47 set. And the necklace does come with the complimentary earrings. If I could turn them around so that you could see. Okay, it does come with the complimentary earrings there. It does have a two-inch extender. And again, it lays down on the neck. It's like three pieces that are hooked together. All right, and it's going to fill up the bus line. Trust me when I tell you. And again, the number for that one is Jazzy 47. All right, on these next uh, three items that I have to show, um, they all have the matching necklace and... Uh, the bracelets, except they're just different colors, okay? So the number's going to be Jazzy 11 for all three of them, but they're going to be in different colors. So if you see one that you like, you're going to come in 11 and then the color. The first one that I want to show you is the brown one. And remember, they all come with the necklace and the matching bracelet. So... These are ten dollar sets, not five dollars a piece, and that, and I don't want them broken up either because they match uh, perfectly. 
Here the name of this particular necklace is called the Albuquerque Artesian and it is brown. Remember the number for it is Jazzy 11 because it comes with the matching, look at this, brown bracelet. These are class bracelets, lobster class bracelets, okay? I think it does have a 2 inch extender on it. So it's a perfect set, Jazzy 11. The off, the off side to that is that I also have it in black. Alright. And again, this is Jazzy 11. Alright. I have it in black. Of course, I need to put it on here correctly. I have, okay, Jazzy 11 comes in black. And all of them do come with the matching earrings. See those little cute though? Let me put it where you all can see it. The earrings here. That is cute. Looks like it has like a stones path on it. That, you know, the little stones that you put now when you're walking up your sidewalk. Alright, so it has the matching bracelet to it. Again, that's Jazzy 11. And then the third one comes... Oh my God, it's caught on my tablecloth. Ah. Oh. Okay, and I have a little extra one to go with this one, but this is also a $10 piece, okay, and it comes in turquoise with the matching turquoise bracelet. I just pulled the string on my, okay, so we have it in brown, I have it in black, and I have it in turquoise, as you can see. Alright, and again, the numbers for those are Jazzy 11, alright. For all three pieces. Has that crackle stone in it. Now if it's something that I love. I love turquoise. Before I even started doing paparazzi. It was just great for me. To add to that. Look at this. I do have a turquoise ring though to go with it. It has the spacers there on the side. Look at that. All of our rings are um have the stretch back to them. The accordion back. And that particular ring it does have the crackle stone in it, just like the necklace. And the number for it is going to be Jazzy 46. Now, the ring is $5 plus tax. $5 plus 8% sales tax. That's going to be $5.40. All right, let's get to a question. Let's see what y'all know. Let's see what y'all know. Okay. Oh, Lord, I don't want to put that. I don't want to even talk about that. All right. Listen to this quote. <laughs> I got this one wrong. Okay. When Hananiah wrongly predicted to Jeremiah that the Jews would be free of Babylonian rule in two years, by how many years was he in error? Because they weren't free in two years. They were free in a whole lot of years. So he called himself going to predict how long that the Jews, this is a hard question, would be free of the Babylonian rule. He said they would be free in two years and they were, he was off by how many years? Nope, not 40. I wonder why y'all defaulted to 40. 40 years in captivity. Huh? No, he was off. I'm going to give you a hint. He was off by more than 40. <laughs> All right. Now, why y'all are thinking about that answer? I may have to ask another question. Right now, Miss Linda has one. Precious has one. How many years was he off? More than 35? Okay, if it was... Okay, y'all not listening to me. 68 is the correct answer, Miss Coley. If if it were more than... I don't understand that. I told y'all it was more than 40 and the next person put 35. <laughs> hey, did the next person put 25? Now, how did you get that right? Because that was, I did not know that. It was 68 years he was off. I said, he don't need to predict nothing. 60 was a close guess, but it was 68. And you'll find that answer uh, in two places. Chronicles uh, 36 and 21, and you'll also find it in Jeremiah 28. 
Oh, you just guessed? I thought you was super smart. I thought you was super smart and you just knew it. But he actually was off by 68 years. So what we said, what we're going to say, if you ain't heard from God, don't you go speaking to nobody else, okay? <laughs> Y'all, it is dangerous. It is dangerous. I remember uh, our bishop said one time, it's dangerous to operate outside your gift. <laughs> I mean, you just don't know what it brings death to the person. So Hannah and I, he wrongly predicted that. I tell you the truth. Don't be telling nobody that. Okay, Miss Linda. You got uh bag. Bag five is the only one you can't choose. So choose a bag. While you're choosing a bag, I'm going to get ready. I only have two more pieces to show. I'm going to get ready for... Well, I'm going to go ahead and do the... Well, I could do the finale. I guess I won't show that. I will hold that to next time. Bag number two. Bag number two, then we're going to show our finale. Bag number... Y'all know I hold you but an hour. And I have a reason why I do that. I have a couple of reasons. The main reason, Instagram won't let me post over that. That's the main reason. <laughs> yep. Okay. Bam, you got two items. You have this nice, lovely, I don't know if it's leopard or le I don't know what kind of pink panther. I don't know what it is. But it's a snap bracelet, as you can see there. It has those two bars on it. It does have uh, uh, two different levels there. Just snaps on. I don't know if you got any pink leopard stuff. And you have two hair clips. That is that mauve color. These are hair clips, okay? What do y'all think she should do? Should she keep those or should she trade? What would you do? Miss Jewel say it don't matter what you But anyway, we're just offering up some suggestions. Y'all think she should keep it? I don't know what she gonna do. If you go to a biker's party or something, I don't know. Alright. You wanna keep what's in two or you wanna... Let it ride. <laughs> oh, she said one. <laughs> Miss Jewel, what you said, trade? Okay, Bella's it's nice at trade. <laughs> I don't know why y'all don't like that. That's nice. Now, precious. <laughs> oh, Lord. she said trade. Remember, whatever is in bag number one, you got to keep. All right, let's see. It's one item in bag number one. All right, let's see what we got in bag number one. All right, give me a minute to open it. This, y'all do know this is brand new stuff. All right, while I'm getting inside of here, I want to talk about these lovely earrings that I have on there. The silver and this and this ring here. Uh, I know Minister uh, Sanders uh, menace. She wear this with her cowboy stuff, okay? This is this nice star ring that I have on. If you would like to purchase the ring, okay? It's Dallas Cowboy Star. I guess that's what she would say. Or these earrings here. They are silver. The number's going to be Jazzy38. All right? All right. So, Miss Coley, this is what you have won, my dear. This is a steel. You may like this. This is a steel gray necklace here. You have your smaller chain with your larger chain there. It does come with the complimentary earrings that you can see. It does have a two inch extender on it. And it has a little weight to it too. So that means that it's heavy. Okay. Hey. That's a good deal. Take the earrings off and may make a good gift for your son's birthday. Tell him I said happy birthday, by the way. I know he don't talk to me, but he know me when he see me. All right, all right. That's what you got coming your way. All right, with your other stuff, I'll keep. All right, let me find your name, cause I keep your name. She said, "Okay, okay." All right, I'm glad. Now let me show my final piece for tonight. My final piece. For tonight is a Z piece, which means it's a $25 piece, okay? With tax, it's going to be $27. All 
the name of this particular Z is called the Majestic. You know, I thought about, I thought about, it was a drug deal on one of them shows. His name, I said, why would he name himself Majestic? But anyway, then I thought about the Almighty God and all of His majesty and His glory, okay? And then it, I said, okay, you're so welcome. You all, thank you all for coming on every week and sharing with me. Thank you so much. And thank you, too, for when you purchase. Thank you for those who have ordered something on tonight. I really appreciate it. All right? I really appreciate it. It's tax time. Y'all know I appreciate everything you do. Okay? But remember, the name of this is called The Majestic. All right? And when I saw it, I was thinking about our Heavenly... Well, I thought about that drug dealer first. Then I thought about our Heavenly Father. And look at this, ladies. O-M-G. And I'm not taking the Lord's name in vain. We're saying, oh my goodness. Look at this. Look at all of these rhinestones. The large ones and then the smaller ones that you see in this. Can you imagine having this on? And it uh, I've seen um, some paparazzi consultants with turtlenecks with this on. It was great. And I've seen them with the open shirts and have this on. And I was like, oh. And when I saw a few of them had on the same necklace, I said, I have to get one to put in my store. And that's exactly what I did. It does come with the matching complimentary necklace, okay? I mean earrings. It is not a necklace, earrings uh, that you see there. And all of the, and you'll see why it is. it costs more money. This is so beautiful. And the number for it is going to be Jazzy 58, okay? Jazzy 58. Look at that. Look at how beautiful that is. You like it? I love it. All right? Jazzy 58. Maybe give yourself some time to think about it. Okay? But that thing is gorgeous. It's gorgeous on. Okay? I'm going to bring it in for an up close and personal look. Oh my goodness. And it's just it's playing off of my pegboard there. But. Alright. I think everybody should own at least one Z piece. All right, and maybe when this COVID is over, we'll get together, come together, and have an opportunity to wear them all. I want to say thank you to everybody for joining my live. It's been hilarious. It's been a hoot. It's been a great time. Don't forget to pray for those in the Ukraine, okay, and for those that are lost, all right? Y'all have a great Sunday. Bye-bye.